The surviving son of convicted murderer Alex Murdoch opens up about the murder of his mom and his brother in an exclusive interview with our own Martha McCallum. While Buster Murdoch agrees that his dad has psychopathic characteristic, he still thinks the jury got it wrong and his dad's innocent. And we saw the whole trial right here on Fox. Nate Foy is here with more. Nate. Well, thanks for having me, guys. Uh, in the fall of the House of Murdoch on Fox Nation, Buster admits that he's confused by some of the evidence presented at the trial earlier this year, but ultimately, he still thinks his father is innocent of murder. So right now, Alec is serving two life sentences for murdering his wife, Maggie, and his son, Paul, in 2021 to allegedly cover up financial crimes. Buster says he thinks that's a weak motive. Now, in the documentary, Buster explains the moment that he learned his mother and brother were killed. It was in a phone call with his father. And he insists, now over two years later, he still has no doubts his dad is innocent of murder. Did you ever go there and say, maybe it's possible that he did this? No, because I think that I hold a very unique perspective that nobody else in that courtroom ever held. So Buster says he even worries about his own safety because he thinks the real killer is still out there. So you see it right here on your screen. Throughout the documentary, there are plenty of new Murdoch family home videos. Uh, there's also a lot of behind-the-scenes trial footage. And we also get the most intimate look yet at the mind of Alec Murdoch. Now, you see footage from all phases of the investigation, as well as his long history of lying to everybody around him. And Martha asked Buster if he now thinks his father is a psychopath. Here was his full answer. When I look up the definition of, of psychopath, like someone who can completely get away with lying and acting normal and carrying through as if nothing's happening, does that describe your dad when you look at those definitions of that? I think there are characteristics where you look at the manipulation and the lies and the carrying out of that such, and I, I think that's a fair assessment. So this week, Murdoch was convicted of two disciplinary charges for providing phone recordings of his journal from prison and using another inmate's PIN number to make a phone call. He lost phone privileges for 30 days because of that. But the fall of the House of Murdoch is certainly an interesting watch. I saw the first episode last night. And you can watch it right now on Fox Nation. All right, well, wow. check it out. Sounds interesting. Nate, thank you very much. You got it. Right. Thanks, Good Nate. Job, Nate. I'm Steve Ducey. I'm Brian Kilmeade. And I'm Ainsley Earhart. And click here to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page to catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis.